Hi, this is the Human Operating System Time. This is a channel for education and technology only. So lately, due to this uh, coronavirus, I have seen so many uh, YouTube videos promoting Taoism uh, to boost the immune system or the uh, Qigong to boost the immune system, all sorts of stuff. And today I'd like to share with you something really critical. Because there are many things out there which really simply doesn't make sense. So, like it or not, we all now is living in an era of change. It is a turning point now. See, in the past few decades, people can talk about <coughs> philosophy, all sorts of stuff. But then, is all of those philosophies accord to what the ancient Chinese present? Or there is just something else? Well, For example, we can talk about, uh, like usually people talk about Taoism. What, what is Taoism? Taoism is about qi, some kind of energy. And then uh, Taoism is about harmony, live in harmony. Okay? And then we often heard about Buddhism. Well, Buddhism is about mindfulness and about what? About this. Uh, Enlightenment. Now, let's ask a question. Do you think the virus care of it is a Taoism or is Buddhism? Does it care? And also, what is this harmony with the nature can do with this virus? Or what is the so-called mindful and enlightenment be able to help us on this virus issue? From my own personal observation on YouTube for this past few weeks, people are, are talking about boosting the uh, immune system, saying that uh, if you practice this and this and that, then one be able to uh, activate the energy and uh, be able to increase the immune system. Is that true in the reality? So, instead of me saying this is not true, this is not true or whatever, I tell you what is the truth. Yes, the truth. When I say the truth, because it needs to deliver. And we need to know the limitation. It is not a philosophy like uh, uh, to study Taoism is to uh, uh, harmonize with this, uh, to be harmony with the nature. You know, what, is, what do you mean? What is nature? What is it? And also, uh, to study Buddhism, then you get enlightenment, you get this uh, mindful, and then uh, you'll be able to non-attach Zen. What, what is that? So, let me share with you something, something serious, something if you are really, really serious on traditional Chinese master or the Qigong, or the, the, the teaching of the, 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 the Taoist or the Buddhist, this is what it is. It never get out from what I'm going to share with you. Okay? So, the first thing I like to share with you is something called proper. Proper. The proper understanding of Buddhism, the proper understanding of the Taoism, proper. 
Papa is not about I am the uh, oldest grandmaster. I am right, you are wrong. Or I am more superior than you. There's nothing to do with proper I'm talking about. Proper I'm talking about is like this. This combination lock. It has its combination in order to, to open this lock. <coughs> to unlock this lock. Only that proper combination be able to unlock it. That proper. Okay? So since this is the uh, the virus time, we all have to stay home. We all, of course, is going to concern about our health, our immune system, right? Now, the key, the bottom line of the Chinese, we always say is something called Jin Qi Shen, right? And in the book, the translations of Jing usually somebody say it's semen, like the, the male's semen. And then the Qi <coughs> is some kind of energy, which nobody knows what the heck it is. Everybody is, is, is talking philosophy, quoting book, but you never see them talk straight. And then you say, well, I have this Qi, I can uh, uh, promote my. Uh, my immune system. But what is Qi? How to measure it? How do we know that we will be able to develop it? And then the Shen, then it was spirit. And then you get into spiritual. And then you get the enlightenment. What the heck is that? So in this time, right now, we need to be really serious to know what is the Jin Qi Shen is about. Only that way we can help ourselves. We can live with today's world. Actually, Jin Qi Shen has no mysterious at all. Everybody be able to, 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 to understand and experience it right away. You don't need to go to the mountain or the cave. <coughs> okay? So what is Jin? <coughs> what is Jin? Jing is not semen. Jing is in today's word nutrition, as I put it in the Wing Chun Inception book, chapter 8. Jing means nutrition, period. Okay? Nutrition, just take that as nutrition. So, what is qi? Qi has two meanings. One, the first thing is your breathing, your oxygen, in today's word. Okay, chi. The second is the energy, which is produced by your nutrition or your food and your oxygen. So you have the jing is your nutrition. You have the chi. Chi means two things. One is the oxygen you intake. The second is the the fusions of the nutrition and the uh, the breathing, and it produce energy. For example, if we eat proper balanced diet, the definitions of balanced diet is scientific balanced diet today, like the Mediterranean diet. Okay, and if we breathe healthily and we have sleep then this diet this uh, this food this uh, this uh, the breathing this oxygen and the rest or the sleeping will produce energy and the second day if we after a good sleep with a good food good breathing the second day we are energetic that is the energy okay so we need to get this straight okay so if anybody talk about i have this move in the, this uh, this martial art or this qigong this type of qigong 
that I can uh, uh, have this chi, activate the chi. Wait a minute. If you don't have the nutrient, you don't eat. What chi do you have? If you can breathe deeply to have all this oxygen you need, what chi you got? If you don't rest, like deep sleep to recover, what chi you get? So never, never believe in people who tell you, if you do this, you activate this chi, and you feel this uh, heat, this is chi. So in this book, I spend chapters here to, to explain, to present chi, how to develop that. Well, the process of the work chi is in, in today's language is going into deep recovery or deep rest state. Deep rest state. Like we sleep, very deep sleep. And the baby sleep very well. So you think about it like a baby, right? Don't we all talk about the Lao uh, the Lao Zhi, Tao De Jing always talk about baby? Well, your baby. Baby, you feed the baby well. The baby is healthy, it breathes well with the lower abs breathing, lower body, uh, lower belly breathing, that is enough oxygen, it has enough rest, the baby will grow. Right? Isn't it true? So that's how it is, Jing and Qi. Okay? So you know it, if you want to uh, uh, Boost your immune system, for example. You need the proper food. You need the proper nutrition. You need vitamin C, you need vitamin C. You need vitamin D, you need zinc, you need that. Okay? Nothing can replace that. On the other hand, you need the oxygen. You need the lower air breathing to, to, to fully use your lungs. And then you need to be able to rest your body so that you'll be able to produce the energy, so like a baby. Okay? And if you look at today's, uh, Google it, okay? How you, uh, you want to uh, produce more, how to say that, uh, to, to, to boost your immune system. Well, you can you can read it scientifically about the T cells and so forth. It will be your nutrition, proper nutrition, and then sleep, and then you want to deal with the stress, reduce the stress, three things, right? Nutrition, reduce stress, have a good sleep. What well, that according to the Jing Qi? We are talking about here, right? So don't 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 get it. Don't buy into say you do this uh, this move, you get this chi. It's just nonsense. The Chinese didn't say that. The Taoists didn't say that. The people, the the, the scholar or the, the 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 real master like a nan Pai Jing never say that. Same with uh, the the the. Grandmaster, the late Grandmaster Ma Li Tang, who is the expert in the Six Healing Sound, uh, Zhou Quan, all the Grandmaster who just passed away decades ago, never say that. Okay? You never say that. And so we want to be really careful here. This is technology. This is not some kind of religion's belief. Okay? It's not those philosophy. Philosophy doesn't solve anything. We can talk about chi all day long and doing all the motion, uh, the, 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 uh, the, the posture and so forth. If we do not satisfy the nutrition, the oxygen, and the rest, you cannot face the virus. It's scientific. Okay? Now, what is sun? What is sun? You will say, what is spirit? Well, let me tell you what is sun. Sun is just 
the strength of your awareness. Yes, the strength of your awareness. So what do you mean by the strength of the awareness? Well, simple thing. If you don't sleep well for one night, the next day you go out there, even you drink a lot of coffee, your awareness is like a like a like, like a your lack of awareness is like a living zombie. The older we are, when we don't sleep well, it's like a living zombie. The next day, the brain doesn't work. Whatever in front of us, we will not be able to aware of it. That's where accident happened. That's where mistake make it, was made. Especially when if we don't sleep for the the, the night, we don't. We, we don't rest, we don't eat properly, and then we go to do the uh, exam. You know, we, we all do that, right, when we're young in the college. Uh, we don't sleep well, we don't eat well, and then uh, we cram the, the thing uh, for the last minute study, and the next day we went to the class when we want to do the exam. Oh my God, I forgot so many things. And sometimes even the the, 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 the question is in front of us, we cannot perceive the entire line. That is the indication of low awareness strength, or in the Chinese it's called low sun. The sun is low. Or no sun. Okay? That, that's what it is. Now, you want the certain stuff, how to, how to, how to uh, develop that? Well, you need the nutrition. Like, like you know, if, when we have good sleep, when we have good food, we have good rest, then our awareness, the second day, it is uh, really, uh, we, we, we are really fresh, and then we can aware of so many things. Instead of whatever put in front of us, we don't see it. So this is Jin Qi Shen. If we do not satisfy this basic, forget about it. No grandmaster can give you energy. Those are just playing mind tricks. Have, you, have we ever seen that a master can give uh, this, uh, this, this baby uh, energy? The baby doesn't have to sleep, doesn't have to feed milk to the baby. The baby doesn't have to breathe. That the baby can grow because it's muscle giving energy. So the reality, the truth is, even in the Tao Te Ching, he said it's like like baby. Well, baby of the Jin Qi Shen, that's what it is. Don't look far, far away. It's within us. Okay. Now. Harmony with the nature. First, one needs to know what the heck is this in Jesus. If one has no idea of this, one couldn't even live. If you want to want, one want to practice qigong, internal art, one needs to clear with the in Jesus. Without the experience of this, what are we doing? Living in delusion, keeping, keeping making up things. Well, in a good day, you can get a, away from it. In the time like this, the virus time, if you really have the chi, why don't you go out there? Don't have to wash your hands, see whether you get it or not. Or well, don't you have chi? So let's, let, let's stop doing those things which is actually damaging us. That those are really ignorant things, like the Buddha said. Buddha said it's ignorant. That's ignorant. Because we do not know the proper way as this combination. So today I share with you that Jin Qi Shen is like this combination law. We know what is nutrition, what is the breathing and the body energy and the the strength of the awareness. There is the three things, the three treasure of human. It's not 
something come out of the blue, or you just do some posture, you can handle those things. Okay. Now, let's talk about a little thing about this screw up mindfulness thing. Without that Jing Shi Shen, there is no such thing as mindfulness. There is none. So, when in the Buddhism, when people practice the Samatha, Samatha meditation, that has to deal with one's body, okay, nutrition, breathing. Then people, you know, the Buddhists have to practice the Anapanasati. Those are breathing stuff. So the body has to be in the lotus posture, a proper posture, so that the body can rest. And of course you need nutrition. What people say, why well, I don't need nutrition? No. Look at it. Even the Buddha, look at, read the Buddha's second morning Buddha story, before he enlightenment. He have to drink that milk, okay, from the, uh, the, the the shepherd, right? Or else he died. He will not be able to enlighten. Him. So you need the nutrition. Even the Buddha have that. They practice the anapanasati, which is the the breathing. The body is in the lotus posture where they can rest their body. And that way, they can produce this energy and thereby they get the strength in their awareness that is entering into the Samadhi. And with that, okay, that, that, that physical and the mental and the body energy Level only that they can have a mindfulness, and only with mindfulness at that state, they be able to practice vipassana, very sharp of uh, analyzing things or observe observe uh, observe the, the 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 thing. Okay. So without that, uh, that, that, that shen, which is the strength of the awareness, forget about this. You're going to sit down there, you say, well, I'm going to uh, count my breathing, I'll be mindfulness. What are you talking about? It's not like that. You have to have that prepare, that human has to prepare to get into the physiological state. Okay? So that is the samatha meditation. At that time, they can get deep into Samadha, they build all the energy. That's why the Chinese Qigong is actually is a type of Samadha. Okay? And on top of that Samadha meditation, one has the strength of the awareness and one be able to observe really clearly on things and and thus one be able to see that this world is actually impermanent we need this body okay it's not just philosophy oh get enlightenment are you enlightenment yes i do and all this kind of thing and you pat my back i pat your back and then everybody be grandmaster and everybody satori. It's nonsense. Okay? The Buddha didn't do that. So you have always have the samatha meditation to get to that level and then get into vipassana. At that time they already have the mindfulness which is the strength of the awareness to the high degree. And then use the strength of the awareness it get into the observation and they be able to to uh, to to have insight of what's going on. So it's just like if you want to study for a PhD, you better we better have uh, have the, uh, the the awareness strength. So when people have this awareness strength in the Chinese, it's called smart. 
meaning the eyes can see clearly, the ear can hear clearly. It's not like that. We go off topic all the way. People talk one thing, we think one thing. When other people talk, we think. We don't listen. When other people see uh, show something, we don't look. We just daydreaming. And then when we ask questions, we just go go completely off topic. And then and then suddenly we just want to debate with people. Those are called not smart. Okay. The Chinese Chinese say chong ming. Chong meaning your ear can see can hear properly. Ming means your eyes can see properly, clearly. And that needs shen, meaning that you need the strength of the awareness. Without that, forget about it. Okay? That's why meditation can help one to be smart because of this. And then on top of this, you can cultivate the vipassana. Then you will see that this world is impermanent because you observe it. It's not philosophy, it's not using your thinking. It's your awareness, very strong awareness, using that for observation and it be able to observe that, okay, get the insight. I hope that this is clean, this is clear, okay? Now, so, so what is the Qigong style practice? Well, like, uh, like in this book, the winter inceptions on the uh, the 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 uh, the uh, nurture tea. What do they do? Well, this is just prepare one so that one's body, mind, and breathing get into the physiological state. That it works with the nutrition and the breathing to produce energy. That's called nurture energy. And uh, with this, in the winter matrix, this is the 2C state. Is to make use of the, 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 the respira uh, respiratory system, uh, the, the, the best, the most effective way of make use of it. Or deep breathing, okay, lower abs, natural lower abs breathing. That, that's what it is. And you need that, right? You said qi gong, energy and breathing. You said qi gong, right? Qi is energy and breathing, right? So qi gong is meaning the way how you, uh, the skill, how you, how you handle the uh, breathing and your energy or how you produce the energy, or how to handle the energy. So, so, so that, that, that is clearly explained here. Now, if one only one breath, how is that one get any qigong? You look at so many people doing all this posture, that san zhuang, but you look at that, it really that guy cannot breathe. Now, if people don't believe me, they don't have to. Today, we have this technology like the Garmin. You check the SpO2, you check the, uh, the, the, the VO2 max, you check the heart rate. You can see many things there, whether the guy can breathe or not. Okay? So that, that's why, again, the H model. In this book, the H model, Just be straight with you. Nobody can get away from the H model. None. Because that is how you want to verify things. The ancient and the science, they are talking about the same thing. And we have verification. That's what the H model in here. Unless we are clear with that, we don't even know how to handle the very basics. If we don't know how to handle the very basic, keeping talking about philosophy, my idea, my opinion, your opinion, who cares? It's just like 450 years ago when the General Chi Ji Guang faced the uh, Japanese pirate. 
Do the Japanese pirate care that you're from Shaolin, you're from Wudang, your internal art? The, this, the, does the, the, the Japanese pirate care for that? Of course, in the history, it doesn't care. So do the virus, does it care? You say, well, this is Buddhism, this is Taoism, or this is Qigong, or this, uh, I learned this uh, from the secret uh, uh, techniques of Qigong, uh, with this grandmaster, does the virus, what, uh, the virus care, or the virus don't even care, because we don't even know our body, we don't even know the, about the nutrition, the, the the oxygen, the energy, the uh, recovery of our body, and the strength of our awareness. We don't even know. We don't even be able to handle it. How are we going to face virus? We are spoiled today. We are spoiled because if we seek we, in today's world, prior to this virus, if we seek, we just want what? We want medicine. We go to see doctor, you fix me. I pay you, you fix me, right? And then uh, if there's virus, then we want vaccine. Okay, I pay you, you fix me. Well, right now, nobody knows how to fix it. And we have no idea on what is this body, this mind is about. And what we learn about this philosophy, this all this uh, secret and ancient thing, Does it work? Or do we even know what the heck it is? Okay. So in the past the few weeks, actually I have talked with the uh, chat with the many uh, martial arts friends, Sifus, on this uh, eight model. And many right away buy the Ghanaian watch or the polar watch, test it out. And everybody, once they go through it, they see the eight model here. They know. They know what they trained before. They know what their Sifu teach them before. And they suddenly, they get insight. Oh, this is what my Sifu tried to tell me. So this is what I'd like to share with you today. It's like a, I lecturing people. I don't like to lecture people. This is a time of life and death. If we don't behave, we don't handle ourselves. We don't eat properly, we don't breathe pro properly, we don't rest properly. Like this uh, Nurgle Chi I talk here. Well, just take it as what? Deep recovery. Okay? This, this uh, we, we, we recover, we deep, deeply recover. That's what, that's what it's about or deep sleep, or deep rest. And if we can do that, we can get into that physiological state. Of course, all this today, God that be able to measure, be able to tell us. That's why all this Masya Sifu friends who talk to me, we, we chat on this each models and the Garmin, they buy the, 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 the the, uh, the wearable, the Garmin, or the, uh, the Massimo, or the, uh, the, the Polar, they never turn back. Why? Because they no longer need to wait, say, oh, tomorrow maybe I can understand this. They don't have to, under, uh, to wait year on, decade, that tomorrow thing will happen. No. You know it right away with this with this models and with the the the, the, uh, the the modern technology. So that's why I say you cannot get away from each model of this uh, winter infection. You cannot get away because that's the reality. Okay. So this is to share with you today. If you really 
like to study the Chinese uh, martial arts, qigong or meditations and uh, you want to develop something, you can achieve it fast if you follow what I'm telling you just now. And you want details in this book, the Winter Matrix uh, uh, Inception book, and you get the, the, the modern gadgets, you can get it in a day. Okay, you don't have to think. And then you'll be able to progress from that. And suddenly whatever the style you practice will make sense. If that is a real deal from the ancient Chinese, not some kind of making up by today's people. Because what the ancient do actually is according to today's sports science. So if you're able to verify. So this is to share with you today.